Imagine sea levels were up here instead of down there. This isn't theoretical, it's happening. Okay, so not in a couple of years, but over a couple of centuries, which means now is exactly when we need to start planning. How we build our cities, how we adapt our coastlines, zoning laws, flood maps, seawalls, wetlands. This isn't abstract, it's about staying ahead of the water. Because even if we cap warming at 1.5 degrees Celsius, the oceans aren't done rising. Scientists just re-ran the numbers, drawing on ancient coral, sediment, fossil shorelines, and found that the last time Earth was this warm, about 125,000 years ago, sea levels were four to 10 meters higher. That's because ice takes time to melt, but once it starts, it's hard to stop. Greenland and Antarctica, that ice won't collapse overnight, but once they go, they don't quit. It's like tipping a jug of water. You can't freeze it mid-pour. Even conservative projections show a one meter sea level rise in 75 years, but it keeps going from there. Right now, about 230 million people live on land less than one meter above sea level. About one billion within 10 meters. That's one in eight people on Earth. So no, your entire city isn't going underwater tomorrow, but this is coming and we've still got time to get ready.